What's good, ladies and gentlemen? This is Vikram G back out to your Coach V TV, and on today's episode, fellas, ladies, whoever the fuck is watching on the other side of this camera, Coach V just came off the best goddamn motherfucking weekend of my life. Not a weekend, my whole goddamn Kelowna trip. We got the fucking PT domination. Consistency King Award, boys. Yes, you, you know it ain't right. Coach, if you come back from Kelowna without bringing back a motherfucking reward out here, yes, this is my fucking victory lap, boys. 2022 Victor Gumi Consistency King, yes, you ask me how your Kelowna trip went. Best motherfucking 10 days of my life ever, boy. And y'all finna see all the fucking footage after this video gets the ball rolling for me. So, we on the borderline of getting monetized. Y'all ain't never gonna see Coach V miss an upload. Do you see what this reward says? Like, I'll take a photo and put it up there on the fucking, on the fucking screen for y'all. Like, so it's crispy and shit. But... Consistency King Boys 2022. This motherfucking our year, bro. And just watch how I walk into 2023 because it all starts now. You know, people are waiting for the new year to come up just to start the goals. It's a no zoo, boy. So, y'all probably ask me why, coach? Why was it the best 10 days of your life? Because I was hanging around all the top dogs of the fitness industry that I'm getting into, bro. Get into, like, the people that are making the most amount of income. I literally got to have conversations with them. I got to think about the words they were telling me, man. Like, learning, absorbing, being a straight-up sponge the whole fucking trip, bro. And how was this possible? This was possible because I went to the place... Where this movement started, my mentor's gym, Iron Energy Gym. I trained there for about nine days, and yeah, man. The atmosphere, the environment, the culture of the gym, just absolutely insane. Where the Free BC movement started, Operation Green Light, and yeah. The gym has about 18K followers on Instagram. You don't really see any gym pages doing that type of shit. They got a movement behind their fucking brand, bro. Yes, so I first of all want to give a shout out to my mentors for let me even have the ability, the privilege, the opportunity to fucking experience an event like this. I literally got to watch Phil Heath, seven time Mr. Olympia champion, reigning, seven time Mr. Olympia champion from 2011 to 2017. Motherfucking give us the game. What it took up here, up here, up here, boys. Not the fucking physique, but the fucking mental fortitude you needed. The mindset, the killer mindset, the absolutely fucking insane mindset you needed to win fucking seven. Mr. Olympia Championships and fucking a whole fucking presentation or speech. No, there's a lot of stuff you told us, man. Number one is you got to keep your standards high, right? Keep your standards high. And the standard I'm going to set for myself is YouTube video upload daily, number one. Motherfucking six TikToks on my fitness page. Three TikToks on my backup page. I even got a gaming page, but I don't know if that's going to... If I'm going to focus on that. But if I do, there's going to be free uploads on there. So, yeah, to become a motherfucking champion like that, it all starts up here, fellas. Right up here, you got to be able to control your mind. And you got to realize, as a professional, you have a job to do, to motherfucking do, bro. And basically, what I learned throughout his speech, this is just Phil Heath's speech, and, like, the whole event is... There's no such thing as balance. Like, I don't come for it all, bro. I want to be the top dog in the industry. There's no such thing as balance, bro. 
I'm coming for uncharted territories, bro. On God, on God, bro. Like, you know, I realized this, man. Like, life never happens to you. It happens for you. And throughout, Phil, throughout Phil's stories, I have 40 minutes of his speech recorded. Which, if y'all actually watch this YouTube video, y'all gotta let me know down below. If you down to let me, uh, if you down to watch me fucking drop the raw footage, or you want me to edit that shit up. Because if I edit that shit up, I'm probably gonna drop highlight clips on my fucking TikTok, and then... I'll drop the uh, raw speech, and then I'll have an edited version as well. But for now, if you guys want that shit ASAP, you gotta let me know if you want that shit ASAP. Otherwise, I'm gonna just keep watching that shit fucking outside uh, without editing it. Fucking just a raw clip. And absorbing the fucking knowledge, the game, the experience, the wisdom from seven-time Mr. Olympia champion. All by myself? But y'all gotta give me at least one comment saying, Yo, coach, drop the fucking raw footage on the 40-minute speech that Phil did. And yeah, man, I'll upload it raw. Fuck it. It's up. This is like a $4,000 ticket I spent the money on. So, like, you know, I'm down to post it for y'all if you try to see it too, you know. So, I'm going to rewatch the video myself again as well, boys. But another great thing Phil told us is we are all motherfucking one of one. You know what I'm telling myself every goddamn day? I am the motherfucking one of one, greatest of all time, Vikram motherfucking G, aka Coach V. And yeah, man. Dude, he also told us like the importance of routines and habits. And, you know, guys, my office is about to go through a glow up. You know? Like, right now. I can see my office. You got a whole bunch of shit in here. And yeah, man, we got. I bought, went to Staples today. Fucking because I bought three different boards 24, 24 by 36 inches. But I'm going to plan out my plans for world domination with. And guys, man, like, my standards. Weren't that high before. Now I need high standards, bro. Motherfucking daily YouTube upload. Motherfucking five random posts on IG. Like, posting one to three reels every day. One to three YouTube shorts. And one proper YouTube upload like this. Me just talking to the fucking camera, bro. Because this is what pumps y'all up, bro. Just the fucking raw Coach V energy, bro. Like, do I really need to fucking be putting out, like, hella fucking hard... Edited the YouTube videos that are like fucking highly productional, high production value shit. Nah, I just want to talk in front of a camera, bro. If you guys like it, you like it. If you don't, you don't got to watch me, bro. Because this is a man rising to the top. If you want to see a man rise from the top, from the bottom, like you can, you got to watch my channel, bro. I ain't going to fucking be doing like all this like hectic Fancy editing shit. I watch Chris Jones. Motherfucking never edit a YouTube video. I we used to watch his raw energy on camera, bro. So, you know, we gotta mute out haters and negative people as much as possible. That's one thing Phil was big on. We are all one of ones and we all have our own stories, our own struggles, our own adversities that we overcame. And you gotta use that to fulfill your greatness and your vision for life and motivate and inspire others others with it, you know, to become the best vision of yours, of themselves, and you always need to rise up under pressure, because as a professional, you have a motherfucking job to do, you know, as an online fitness coach for my clients, I have a motherfucking job to do, and that's to help these guys get in the greatest shape of their life, I gotta leave the race though, right, so that's how we gonna do it. Those three boards, I bought a cork board, I bought a 36 by 24 whiteboard, and I bought a motherfucking, a monthly planner. And you see this wall, how it's hella empty? You know, we're going to have those three boards up, and we're going to fit right in here perfectly. And then here, we're going to have some posters, which I ordered before I went on the trip. And we're going to have a little podcast set up back there. Yes, uh, Coach V office about to get a huge glow up. Make sure y'all like the video, comment, subscribe, because 
Coach V is coming for everybody's neck. I got this award. Now it's time to live up to my name. Every goddamn day, even though I have been, but it's time to do it on fucking social media. The consistency king of social media, bro. So now I got to get my habits and routines dialed in to fucking dominate. You know, have I been dominating before? Not as much as I need to be, bro, because I'm turning 25, T minus October 9th, you know? So my time is coming and I'm going to make it come. Like, I'm going to command my shit to fucking come, bro. Like, it's time for me to fuck the world and get my nut off. That's all I got to say, bro. This video, I'm going to stop it at 11 minutes and 11 seconds on purpose because this is the start of Coach V conquering the universe, dominating this bitch, how the fuck I want to do it. And nobody's going to pop up on their phone more than me, bro. I guarantee this shit because my mind been racing 1,000 miles a second ever since I came back from Kelowna. And during the last four days of the trip was the best motherfucking days of my life ever. So peace out.